Dear learners, welcome to this presentation on emulsion. After watching this video, the learners will be able to define emulsion, know the importance of emulsifying agent in formulation of emulsion and the types of emulsions. Now let us see what is emulsion. An emulsion is a biphasic liquid preparation containing two immiscible liquids, one of which is dispersed as minute globules into the other. As we know, there are two phases in emulsions, dispersed phase and continuous phase. Let us see one by one. The liquid which is converted into minute globules is called as dispersed phase, whereas the liquid in which globules are dispersed is called as continuous phase. To disperse two immiscible liquids for a long period, an emulsifying agent is added. The emulsifying agent forms a film around the globules in order to scatter them indefinitely in continuous phase. In other words, we can say that the emulsifying agent reduces the interfacial tension between the two phases. For example, this is the globule. What actually emulsifying agent does? It forms a film around the globule in order to scatter the globules indefinitely in continuous phase. As we know, in an emulsion preparation, there are two immiscible liquids. One is water and other is oil. We can see here the point where the oil ends and the aqueous phase that is water starts. This point is known as interfacial tension. So to prepare the emulsion, we have to use emulsifying agent. So when we add emulsifying agent into the preparation, we will get a stable preparation of emulsion where one phase is continuous phase and other phase is the dispersed phase. Now let's see the different types of emulsions. There are two types of emulsions that is oil in water emulsion and second is water in oil emulsion. First let us see oil in water emulsion. In this the water is present in continuous phase and the oil is present in dispersed phase. Hence it is called as O by W emulsion that is oil in water emulsion. In second type of emulsion the oil is present in continuous phase and the water is present in dispersed phase. Hence we call it as W by O type of emulsion. Now let us see the difference between O by W type of emulsion and W by O type of emulsion. In O by W emulsion, the oil is in dispersed phase 
and water is in continuous phase whereas in w by o type of emulsion the water is in dispersed phase and oil is in continuous phase the emulsifying agents used in o by w type of emulsions are gum acacia tragacanth methyl cellulose saponins and soaps formed from monovalent bases like sodium potassium and ammonium whereas the emulsifying agents used in w by o type of emulsions are wool fat resins beeswax and soaps formed from divalent bases like calcium magnesium and zinc the o by w emulsions are preferred for internal use whereas w by o type of emulsions are mainly used externally as lotions or creams thank you for your patience listening keep learning